Sydney and I are trying to go to Paris today. Again, the last time we tried to go to Paris, the flight was full, we didn't make it on, so we tried to go to London, and then that flight got delayed until the next day. So we took ourselves off that flight, and Sydney picked up a London trip working for the next day. So we went back to the airport the next day, and then when we got to the airport, Sydney actually got reassigned to work at Buenos Aires, and I got a business seat on that flight. I was like, well, I'll just go with you on that flight, switch our plans. Got on that flight, taxied out, and then they came back to the gate, and then they reassigned Sydney back to work London, and then Sydney's flight to London kept getting delayed. So I gave up and came home, and then Sydney's flight to London got delayed, even more so Sydney actually timed out and she didn't work the trip and we didn't go anywhere. <laughs> and then the other time that we tried to go to Paris, it was during COVID. We had seen that Europe had just opened up traveling restrictions, but I guess France hadn't. I don't know if some places were different than others, but the flight was wide open. So we were like, wow, why not? We got to the airport and they said, you can't get on this flight because you have to have a visa. You like, you have to be a citizen of France to travel there right now. But that one was embarrassing. All of that to say, we haven't had the best luck when we've tried going to Paris in the past. So I'm not prepared at all. I haven't packed. I looked at the weather. It looks like it might be a little chilly. I'm just having some leftover taco soup for lunch. And I also just got a new box of care of vitamins. So I'm gonna take some of these with my lunch. Sometimes if I take vitamins first thing in the morning on an empty stomach, it makes my stomach hurt. But sometimes I like to wait until lunchtime to take my vitamins. But I've been taking these vitamins for a while now. It's super easy. You take a quiz on their website website and then they will send you the vitamins in this nice little box that you can keep on your counter and then they send you a little card that has all of the vitamins that you're taking and why you're taking them so these are great especially if you want to get healthier start taking vitamins but you don't know where to start so if you want to take the quiz and get started with care of the link will be in the description box we're only going for a few days so i'm gonna try not to pack too much i've been trying to throw outfits together in my head but I feel like when you're going on a trip or a vacation or something, you gotta try your outfits on before you pack them. So you know what they're gonna look like and you know if you're actually gonna wear them. I'm gonna bring this coat just in case, but I'm gonna wear it to the airport. Gotta bring my Bluetooth tripod, of course, so we can get some pictures. Gotta have my little essentials pouch. Bringing my little pill container, of course, and just a few vitamin packets. This is a very unorganized pack with me here. I'm really not taking my own advice right now and I'm packing a lot more than I need. <laughs> and I also didn't try any of these outfits on either. But it's a good idea. Do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> okay, I know I look crazy. Just self-tanned because we can't be pale for Paris. I just, on my face, I just did my cheeks, my nose, my forehead. I promise it'll look much better when I have makeup on. So we are gonna try to hit the ground running when we get to Paris. We're gonna try not to take a nap. We're just gonna go out and explore. I'm just putting some curls in my hair and hopefully they last through the flight till tomorrow. I'm not gonna wear makeup on the flight though. I'm just gonna probably do my makeup on the airplane before we land. Just throwing my toiletry bag in here and we are all packed up. Okay, Sid is here. I've already looked through my bags like 15 times, making sure I didn't forget anything. But here I am just checking one more time before I walk out the door. I'm so all right, third time's the charm. Woo I was telling them that this is our third time trying to go to Paris it together. Is. <laughs> oh. I remember we were trying to go in the summer. We we're sitting at my old pool. Oh we're yeah, like, we're going. <laughs> and then we got here and <laughs> we're flights wide open. <laughs> oh shoot, I just jumped. Us again. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. We got premium economy seats and now we have to book our hotel or our Airbnb. We got cute little lunches. We got the nice pillows of them. Oh, and then the headphones. I don't think I've ever sat here. Headphones? Oh. Let's see what's in our amenity kit. A mask, some socks, a little lotion, a little toothbrush and toothpaste. Hot earplugs, that's nice. Oh, this is the cutest little pen. Personnel. Qui n'a qu'un seul souci.
finally made it to Paris. <laughs> Now which way, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm gonna give them a tour of the room. The bathroom's actually kind of big. And then we have a little closet here. We got two twin beds, which I think is super cute. And then our very Parisian windows. Oh, I love it. It's so cute. The room is pretty small, but it's cute and it's in a really good area. Also, the ceiling is very pretty. We are going shopping to find Sydney a bag. Tell them what you want. They're gonna hate me. <laughs> I really want a Chanel bag. And they're cheaper here. I don't know much about this stuff, but I'm here for moral <laughs> support. <laughs> We're looking for the Chanel store right now, but this place, apparently they do the tax thing. I'm no expert on this because I've never bought a designer thing in America or another country, <laughs> um, but you can get like money back from the taxes. That tax? That tax. Um, is what it's called. You do it at the airport, but this place does it for you, so you don't have to do it at the airport. So the flight attendants told us to come here. So there was a very long line at the Chanel store in there. We waited, how long do you think? At least 20 minutes. Like, so we sat there and waited and People were like leaving from the front of the line, but nobody was coming out, so I guess they weren't letting anybody in. So we left. We're gonna try to go to another Chanel store over closer to like the things we wanna see today. Okay, on our way here, Sydney told me she couldn't wait to get a cafe con leche. Which is not the right <laughs> language, I don't think. It's Spanish. <laughs> and it made me laugh so much, so now I just keep saying... Cafe con leche. Cafe con leche. <laughs> but we got a little coffee. We um, needed a little pick-me-up. Yeah, we needed a pick-me-up. Finally, Sydney was about to kill me for making her walk. She didn't let me get the metro. <laughs> okay, we got some pizza for dinner. It looks so good. We're just sharing this margarita pizza. I and this should be lunch. Wait, is it? At what time is it? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is it? I mean, it feels like it's bedtime, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. And we got a nice view of the Eiffel Tower. Okay, here we go. Second attempt. It is now 6 p.m. They didn't have Sydney's bag in the Chanel store. I'm wearing down. I'm exhausted. Oh, we're at the Louis Vuitton. Okay, they didn't have what she wanted in Louis Vuitton either. Um, uh, and I'm just along for, for the ride. <laughs> we are trying to stay out until after dark so we can see the Eiffel Tower sparkle. We can't have come all this way and go to bed before we see the Eiffel Tower spark. But we got a few I'm hours. So I, I know, I'm, I'm done. I could definitely go to bed right now. I've lost my marbles. <laughs> we just went into Cartier. Instead of getting a bag, she decided she wanted a ring. Show them the ring. You guys know I love my ring, <laughs> so I got a, a little nail. So we walk out of the Cartier store after she gets this ring, and <laughs> she says, Okay, don't hate me, but there's another Louis Vuitton store that I want to go to to see if they have the bag that I want. I'm telling y'all, I have been in more high-end designer stores right. today than I ever have in my entire life. Okay, they didn't have her stuffed in the other Louis Vuitton store. We're done. <laughs> We 
got to see her sparkle. It was lovely, uh, except for the performer oh, last night. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to get some hot chocolate. And found this place on Instagram. Good morning. There's a KFC right there. Wait, where? <laughs> There's KFC everywhere we go. In the Maldives, they love KFC. Really? We are going to Versailles today. Neither of us have ever been. This morning we just went and got coffee. And um, skincare. Sydney got some French skincare from the pharmacy that we saw on TikTok. Yesterday we forgot to bring our tripod while we were out and about. At so, the Apple Tower. Yeah, so we didn't really get great pictures. We did get a few that someone took, a stranger who was very nice. But we like to have our tripod so we don't have to ask people. And we forgot it yesterday. So we brought it today, made sure we didn't forget it, and they told us to put it away while we were in um, like the Hall of Mirrors. We did get a few before they told us to put it away. Okay, we are gonna go get some Ladre macaroons now. What else are we doing today? Uh, another sparkle show at the eye. <laughs> she calls the Wait, does not everybody say that. I don't think that they commonly re refer to the sparkling apple tower as a sparkle show, but oh. I like it. I mean, they might. I didn't even realize. <laughs> There's good old KFC. It makes me laugh how much other countries like Kentucky Fried Chicken because I feel like Kentuckians don't really eat it. Steak and fruit. It started raining while we were eating. We just finished eating and we came over to Notre Dame. The last time I was here was in 2019 and they were doing construction on Notre Dame after the fire happened. So they were doing construction on it. I didn't get to see it. I didn't really get to get close to it at all. So I was like, surely by now they'll be done with that. So we came over here and there's like a big wall all around it. You can't get close to it. And they're doing a ton of construction on the sides too. This is a really pretty spot to see it, but coming up on the side, like there's construction all down the side of it and in the back. So we're a little sad. You just zoom in and look that bad. That's true. <laughs> but gosh, I mean, I you used to be able to just walk right in. So now we're gonna go to the Luxembourg Gardens and um, I'm also going to show Sydney where I lived when I studied abroad here. Yeah, I'm excited. It's so cute. There she is. We can sit at that terrace at the top and see the Eiffel Tower. Watch Stop. the Sparkle Show every night. Oh, isn't that cool? I love it. It was the best. Ice cream, That's yeah. true. Now this is exactly what I came to Paris for. A New York hot dog. It looks like it is gonna rain on us again. And do you think either of us have an umbrella? No. But we are on our way to the Louvre now. And then what after that? We want to go home and change. Spruce up and then go back to the sparkle show tonight. I love that Sydney calls it the sparkle show. <laughs> we made it to the Louvre. Yeah. Okay, we are just chilling here at the Louvre. Sydney finally found a bag. They finally <laughs> had something that she was looking for. Do you want to show them? Yeah. Or wait till we get to the hotel. A little unboxing. Okay, yeah, yeah, we'll get to the hotel first. We're leaving tomorrow. We're leaving at like, what do you think, 8 a.m.? Our flight's at 11.25. So we're gonna get there early so that Sydney can get her fat tax thing taken care of. Just turned around, we went the wrong way. We're still debating whether we wanna go to the Sparkle Show tonight or not. Can you tell um, Casey's cold here with her clip? Yeah, I, <laughs> I clipped my jacket because I've been like holding it together all day because I've been cold and it just like won't stay up. So I just put my hair clip on the collar to keep it together and it actually worked quite well. I wish I would have figured this out earlier today. But yeah, we're still deciding if 
we want to go to the Sparkle Show tonight or if we just want to sleep because we're going to have to get up early. This is the key to our door. <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. Okay. Like, not that you guys just saw that, but like Casey literally just used her white <laughs> bodysuit oh, right yeah. here to clean her lens. Nothing I forgot came it off, was white. <laughs> Unboxing Sydney's <laughs> new bag. It's actually very cute. It was the last one left, so I feel yeah. like it was meant to be. It was a sign. They said they had one of them. I'm nervous. Beautiful. Yay! She is beautiful. And then they were saying I could do like her. The little chain. Or I could do like her very cute and then i can make her bigger yeah so it can turn into like a crossbody it's nice it's super cute it smells really good thanks for coming along y'all <laughs> <laughs> along for the whole ride all <laughs> eight stores that we oh went to okay that is it for this video i don't think we're gonna go to the sparkle show tonight um boom y'all <laughs> suck we could but we, i mean we gotta be up early and we went yesterday. If we didn't go yesterday, we would definitely go tonight. Yeah. So thanks for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed it. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Mm -hmm.